Hello everyone for God in the year. Today I'll be teaching you guys how to counter Hitman style, aka what to do if you're fighting a Hitman main. We all know they have insane reach, insane range, and we know we don't know how to beat them properly. So uh, yeah, today I'll give you guys some tips. So let's get right into it. Alright, as always, I'm joined by my boy Poison guys. So we we're chilling right now. Soul Goodman right in this. I'll be using Hitman for demonstration because he doesn't have it. He's gonna use counter style. What style are you using? Bullet. Alright, bullet will do, I guess. So let me give you guys a few styles that I get to counter Hitman right away. So on the screen, I'll put a couple of styles that are really good at countering Hitman. Bullet, you have counter style, you have ghost style, and even Wally a little bit. So let's get right into it. First thing you need to keep in mind when fighting Hitman users is they're most likely gonna run around corners like this. And the first thing you should not do is run into them like Poison is running into me because you'll get perfect dodge like he just did an M1 and then they'll just back off. So how do you counter them being passive? You counter it by being passive yourself. Now what do you do? Poison, stay out, stay like in the middle of the ring, right? So if I'm on the ropes, right? You wanna stay there where you are. Don't get closer because I might hit you. But just kind of stand there as I'm running away from you. Just stay in the middle and just kind of like do this and move around and do a little bit of feints. Go back forth a little bit. Yeah, I'm laggy. Yeah, do that. And then a Hitman main is more likely to be inclined to get into you and try to M1 you. And when they miss their M1, that's when you strike. So if they're being very passive, stand close to them, but just a little bit out of their range, right? So stay close to me. So I, I can't hit you, right? But you got to provoke me. You gotta provoke me, right? My pink is so bad, bro. So you gotta, like, provoke me, right? From a distance. And then when I miss my shots, that's when you go in. So that's how you deal with hit passive hitman users. That's the tip number one. All right, tip number two we would have is obviously to put pressure on them. So as I said, a lot of feints... A lot of stuff. Yeah, I'm a passive hitman right now. Right now, I am a passive hitman. So you gotta do... So what you also gotta do is you gotta put pressure on them. Suppose to just, like, get closer to me. Get me to throw shots at you when I throw. When I throw my shot and miss, that hit me. Hit me when I miss. There we go. There we go. Don't, don't get too close, though, because then I can just M1 you from a very close distance, which is faster for me. Try to not dash into my hits, okay? Just, just, you gotta put pressure on me, right? You gotta put pressure on me. Okay, don't let me put pressure on you, though. So this is what Hitman users will do, right? They will just stay out of your range like this. They'll try to, they'll, 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 they'll try to keep you in a corner, then strike when they know they can. How you counter this is literally with feints and just doing what poison do. Just, like, randomly dashing in, landing a hit, and backing off, right? Or continuing the combo. That's how you counter when a Hitman's trying to put pressure on you. That's how you counter them, right? As you can see, I'm trying to hit him it's not going well for me because hitman mains can't really rush at this point they're meant to be really passive all right so now you know what to do when your hitman main is pressuring you and how to deal with a passive hitman main now we get into the actual stuff so the actual key to fight a hitman is kind of staying in the middle of the range if you're too far off they're gonna outbox you if you're too close they're gonna hit you first but if you stay like at the point if you stay where poison's at like that okay you're not you're, you, you gotta get the timing of it down there you go there you go there you go so you gotta stay just out of my reach there you go there you go. There you go. As you can see, when he does, he can counter me, and he's doing a lot of counters. So, uh, yeah, there we go. Like that. Literally simple like that. Good job, Poison. Good job, Poison. As you can see, my health is already gone. All right, now, next thing, I'm going to teach you how to run away from Hitman users if you need to heal. So, Hitman main is generally slow, right? So, your, your main idea is to dash back once and then just dash around them. So, like, if I'm in the center, right? Dash back once to the corners. And now I'm trying to hit you, right? Dash to the sides. Yeah, just dash like that. Don't dash into me. Dash back into the sides. Only back into the sides. You can dash back like that. Don't get too close, though. Don't get too close, though. Dash out of it. That, there you go, like that. There you go, like that. There we go, and you can counter them on the corner. As you can see, you're already getting an anti-Hitman strategy just by doing that. Now, what you want to watch out for is Hitmans have a really long guard, so, uh, guard breaking them is not really gonna be an easy task. Hit, hit my guard, hit my guard. So, as you guys can see, uh, getting a Hitman's guard down is a really difficult task, generally, so you're gonna want to be careful. Most people want to do the break guard and ultimate strat. That doesn't really work with Hitman, because they regenerate fast and they have a lot of guards. So, you're better, you have better chances of, uh, landing your ult when you're perfect dodge them. Which brings me to the the next thing which is learning how to perfect dodge hitman m1 so hitman m1 generally always swing into the one side they they do both sides now but essentially you gotta learn how to perfect dodge them all right please try to perfect dodge my m1s just sort of like pd them try to perfect dodge them. there you go that's one dodge more there you go there you go I suggest if you don't, if you if you need to practice, get a friend that has hitmen and just do this with him. Like get in the ring, just get him to swing at you, get him to swing at you, and eventually you'll get down the perfect dodges against him. And your friend just needs to like do these M ones at you. There you go, and eventually you will learn how to dodge them like that. So he's already doing a lot better. So just get a friend on, get somebody you know on, make them help you perfect dodge, make them help you like fight hitmen users. Alright, so now you guys know the basics of fighting hitmen. So the next thing you gotta do is infuriate them. So you gotta make them angry, right? Because when they're rushing at you and coming at you and being a little aggressive, you're going to easily beat them. So, like, I'm coming at you constantly, right? 
I can't dash. I'll run out of stamina. And when I run out of the stamina, that's when you attack. You gotta bait them into dashing. So, like, run away from me. Run away from me. I gotta dash into you. Then you just beat their ass when they when, when they run out of stamina like that. Ooh, you can also do one more fun fact, guys. Which is, if you wanna hit, hit a Hitman user, go in front of them like this. And they just stand there, right? Don't even throw any shots. Wait till they use their one or two dodges. Then start throwing shots, right? So, if I'm coming close to you, right? I get to you. You gotta wait before I before you do that. Now you hit. Now when you see I've dodged, then you attack, right? And if I try to like attack you the second I get there, just you gotta just counter me, right? If I just ra rush into you and attack, you gotta just counter me like that. There you go. There you guys have it. You have the perfect countermeasures to beating Hitman right away. So let's show you what a match with that would look like. Let's get into it. But let's have a normal match and just use everything that I've taught you. So you can see, as a Hitman main, you can already see how powerless I am against some of the things he does. I have a pretty good guard and all that, but it, it's still so so much harder to uh, do anything. And uh, yeah, let's see how Poison does. Remember, guys, these things, these tips, it will, they will require a lot of practice and it's gonna take you a lot of time to actually get used to doing this but once you get it see once you get it down it becomes very easy but they might try to time you like this so never panic dash just try to perfect dodge them while they're doing this because they will try to do this you just gotta dodge one hit and then then counter remember don't get countered poison keep your distance from me keep your distance from me a little bit dash back dash back out of my m once there we go just like that and then counter you gotta counter me come on there you go, there you go, there you go, there you go. It's really hard to get the timing down against Hitman users, because, uh, you know, it, it's Hitman users. But once you get it down, the first few basics at least, it becomes a lot easier. So look at that, there you go, there you go. Okay, you, you caught me once. There you go, there you go, there you go. You, got, you gotta dodge their M1, counter a few times, dodge again, back off, and then hit like it. There you go, there you go. You just gotta be careful because they will try to like block your shots. If they block your shots, wear their guard a little bit down and just back off. Don't run out of stamina though, that's a bad thing to do. See, they can also do this too. They can just be annoying. Like, they stand in front of you with a guard and just dodge your M1s and they just counter you. In that case, just do the same exact thing to them. By the way, they will wear your guard down very quickly, so you gotta take a couple of shots in your guard. Yeah, there you go. That's the best way. When they're rushing into you, like when they're going into you, that's when you use your M1s and M2s. So like, as like as they're going in, into you, like rushing into you, that's when you can counter them the most easily. There you go. Now when I'm rushing into you, that's you gotta throw more M1s, boys, and throw more M1s. Come on, you gotta do better than that. It takes you gotta do more combos, bro. Don't make it predictable. You're too obvious. There you go. Your timing has to be a bit off. There you go. Just like that. Remember, guys, these take practice, so as you can see, Poison is doing significantly better against Hitman than he would have usually, but these do take a lot of practice and getting used to, so don't don't be surprised if it doesn't work the first few times. Remember, guys, practice makes perfect. And this is, now when I'm trying to back off, now you can, like, catch me, or, or like, with your M1, when I'm trying to, like, run away while I have no guard, but if my guard's up, then don't do it. There you go, just like that. So just stay out of my range, make me miss, and when I miss, that's when you rush in. By the way, if you see they're gonna swing for an M2, you can easily counter their M2, because you have, like, faster speed, like that, see? Alright, as you can see, Poison is already doing significantly better against Hitman, he just needs more practice. Alright guys, so as you've seen in the video, uh, you can do it, it just takes a lot, a lot of practice and a lot of trying. So yeah, l l l practice with your friends and get better. Uh, thank you for watching, that's how you counter Hitman, and goodbye.